Welcome to F5 in Ansible Lessons, deleting a previous configuration. In the past few lessons, we have done things such as create virtual servers, replacing SSL certificates, and creating iRules. What about the times you want to revert those changes or just remove them? This lesson will go over those scenarios. So we'll first log into the Ansible automation platform. Next, we'll go into our project section where our GitHub repository is already pre-configured. Then we're going to head over to inventories and check out our big IP inventory for our demonstration. Notice there are two groups, load balancers and web servers. And then in each group, there are two subsequent hosts. One contains for the web servers, which are Docker hosts, and the other for the big IPs. Next, we'll go into the templates and the 1.4 delete virtual server. As in the previous lessons, we're part of the default execution environment project and inventory, and we have variables defined for what we're going to remove, including the I roles and the SSL certificate names. While we wait for the code to start up, what we'll notice is that as part of the code, it will go and find whichever of the two big IPs is the active machine. They're set up in an active standby pair. When it tries to execute that code, it is only going to execute the code on the active machine. So that way, when they synchronize across each other, then the two big IPs will have the same data, but only the active machine will be the one that's configured. Now going in and logging into the big IP, we go over to local traffic, virtual servers, and notice there's nothing there. We'll check out the profiles, SSL profiles, Notice that that's gone as well. Pools, nothing there. Nodes, same thing. And going into our iRules, there's nothing there. It's as if they were never configured in the first place. And you might ask, why didn't I just restore from the backup? I could have totally done that. However, I wanted to show how it was done through Ansible as well. Feel free to use or fork our own Git repository code located in the link below and watch our other videos for more F5 and Ansible lessons.